Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our modded series. So, okay, the drought is nearly over. I did just very minor a uh, couple of things whilst we were waiting for the rainy season again. So, right, the farming area is now tidied up and I think we already confirmed in the last episode as well that we are not going to put a separate district in this corner. So all we've done is built a whole ton of uh, levees here just to allow the water to go through and as soon as the rainy season starts I think we are gonna remove this block from here so hopefully we will not forget this but okay so moving on log piles are now in here as well so we can store a little bit more plus we have uh, allowed us a bit more space now in here with the bakeries and the next step really is to bring the grills over as well to cook up some potatoes and maybe maybe something else as well. Who knows? All right, let's look up here. Um, yeah, so this area has been going or developing pretty slowly, if I'm completely honest. Every now and then I revisit this district, put down a couple of more roads and wooden stairs. They complete those sections pretty slowly as well. But you know what, we are not in a rush, so it's fine. I think right now what they are doing... Okay, so you are trying to complete this section here. There's only two columns. One of them is harvesting the dead trees at the bottom of this hill, whilst the other one is constructing. And to be fair, I don't think we need to be any quicker with those tasks. Okay, so yep, no changes in here. Uh, what I've also done is we've completed, again, uh, lots of levees in here and another dam section is now complete. This one seems to be a little bit higher than this one. So, yeah, we, we're going to have to raise you a little bit later as well. Uh, let's have a look. This section is coming along pretty nicely and I think we can complete you. Let's have a few more right there. You might actually spill over. Well, let's do a couple in here. No, let's do three. Okay, and that should be fine. We shall pull you through just like so. And then we just have the last little section to finish off as well. All right, we've got a few dynamites. And I think access-wise, uh, we are going to have to climb down from somewhere for sure. Okay, we can do those last corners in here. Alright, there we go. And there's a few, few more bits, just like so. Okay, so that's those dynamites. We have also... Oh almost detonated our way all the way to the bottom yep now it's red and as you can see i've already queued up a whole bunch of uh, platforms for the beavers to complete as well uh, what is something a little interesting here is i was going to put ladders all the way to the top uh, with the hopes to you know keep the blueprint to a minimum but after the second one the third ladder it says construction site is too far from a district which is pretty unusual i'm not sure what else could i do differently here um they definitely have access if we highlight the district center all right here we go come over here and you most certainly do have access so <laughs> the immediate fix that I might have might involve this. So let's uh, change you up a little bit. We shall try. Let's have a look. We need ladders. Uh, let's place you here. If two is the most we can do, well, so be it then. Uh, do you need this one here? Let's take a look. Maybe we just need a little supportive set of ladders right next to you 
Uh, we'll find out. We'll leave them be. They're just gonna finish a couple more platforms over there. Yes, I know it doesn't look very pretty, but we are gonna need some backup power when the wind is down. Uh, I think overall, yep, there's plenty of power going through. Uh, by the way, we've also reached 5,000 science points. So... Which one is more important? Hmm, well, in total we're gonna need 15,000. Because we want those assemblers... Uh, actually parts, we are... We're pretty good on the parts right now. So factory... Hmm, do you know what? Never... Doesn't matter. We'll just unlock you. And do we have any more spare bots? No, we don't, but I'm pretty sure you are no longer needed. No, you are needed. Because we do want to start planting some trees. Uh, only problem we have is we don't have any planks to construct you, so... Let's see, let's do another route. And planks, where are you? Right over there. Okay. Wonderful. He shall send over... Uh, actually, let's just check this real quick. We don't need a whole hundred here. Five is more than enough. Okay, so there we go. Uh, drought has finally ended as well. And now what I have done here is I've... I think I already showed in the last episode as well that we... Or mentioned it, that we might automate this a little bit. So we've placed a few stream gauges, uh, just like so. So this one now, currently, is control, uh, controlling this gate here. Okay, so if this um, gauge is, uh, is, let's have a look. Advanced, low threshold is uh, 0 0.1 right now. So right now this one detects 0 0.07 of water. It's pretty low and what it says is, hey, I don't have enough water here, please release some more. Um, so this gate opens, but right now we don't really have any water, so what happens is a bit of a chain reaction. This one is set up pretty similarly to the previous one. Uh, you are connected to this uh, stream gauge over there, and the same thing. If there isn't enough water in this pool, then please open the gates above. Okay, and the last level is here. And the exact same thing. If this one says, uh oh, not enough water open the gates and there we go actually are you oh wait a second you are not connected uh there we go so the last one we still have to set up if it's let's do zero point now nah, you can stay as one one as well so low drop it all the way to the bottom high threshold i think we can do it up to here and now we can set you to a three okay beautiful and now this area should start filling up as well cool all right so i believe i showed off not showed off but i presented what i kind of want to construct this in this area and this although this link looks a little bit awkward like why do they have to go all the way around uh, it is not going to stay like this so what i would like to do somewhere around this area I'd like to have a, a system of bridges that crosses the stream, so they're not going to walk along the dam. This might be a little too dangerous. And uh, now, even though actually those bridges don't look very safe either, but essentially, yeah, we just want to have a couple of bridges cross over and then maybe have a lot, another skyscraper uh, for beaver housing right on this side of the hill. But because this hill is very, you know, uneven, we could, of course fill it up with levees and, um, you know, start constructing as well. But levees aren't going to look very nice and lovely at all. So what we do want to do is we'd like to start terraforming. Okay, so you dirt excavator is going to take 2,000 science. We only have 1,000 right now. Uh, so maybe we, we are going to have to wait for the science a little bit. But let's have a look at this ladder system. It seems to have worked... Okay, so if we give you another... Well, let's first see how many can you do. Okay, so you can't do this one. Gotcha. So maybe we give you a platform right about here. 
with the highest priority. Okay. Get this one done. Why are you going all the way there? Uh, because they probably have nothing else to do right now. Alright, we also do have a spare golem. Um, shall we? We shall. Yes. Where are you actually? Uh, which district? Is it the main one? Yes, it is main one. Let's have a look at you as well. So we can pause you. Oh, you're gonna steal 500 of our science. Uh, is it worth it? No, we want the excavator going. So why don't we pull, let's say, just one beaver for a little bit. And as soon as you can get this all done, we can send you out from here to, uh, I guess, forestry. These We are going to have to rename those districts as well because it gets a little, oh, I think. Ah, oh, wait a second. No, it didn't go from here. Hmm. You are District 7. Okay. Off you go. Pause this building so we know no one's working here. Well, there is technically one uh, bot. And you are not really doing anything, are you? So, okay. Let's make it easy on us. Uh, send the last one out as well. And all we have right now is just a forester that cannot do anything, of course. Uh, because we still have this levy here. Right. And you are going to start putting down some water. Because there isn't, it isn't detecting any. Um, don't really want to waste any water. If I'm completely honest. Okay, so let's have a look at you. All these gates seem to be closed now. Because there's plenty of water coming through. You already flooded... Ah, parts of this area. Maybe we need another levy. Just to manage the water flow. Okay, we'll set up another one there. And how many science points? Okay, 1,200. No power. Let's have a look around. Is it? Yes, it is. Seems to be getting a little bit more green, so we can now... Start planting some of those trees. It is night time. Ah. I did not miss this at all. Sending them back and forth, I mean. Uh, right. I think the general water level in this tank is fine. But in the colony itself, we're not really filling up the uh, other tanks in here. Now you're saying we still have two more spare columns. Oh, okay, three actually. Oh, that's very interesting. You have one extra one here but we could do two in there so why don't we send you over as well off to forestry one and two all right there you go uh so what i'm thinking to do here is a couple more let's try and expand you just a tiny bit yeah a few more bumps now what i'm not sure of should we keep this no, I don't think we need this additional access or point of access anymore. And all of you seem to be paused. Okay, we can take you out. I don't think we need this stuff in here anymore. Alright, perfect. And you can be unpaused now as well. Beautiful. So that should allow us to do... About two more water pumps here. Uh, wrong button. Here we go. Okay, so you guys got not, uh, something to build. And do we have to connect you up? Oh, you are connected to that one. Okay, let's do the same. You are controlled. And same with you. Pause when below. Unpause when above. Below, above. Oh. I think we have to... Oh, never mind. No, we don't have to set anything. All right. That makes it a lot easier. Cool. So what shall we... Oh, wait a second. How are you... Overflowing into that area? Let's take a look. We've got only three... Okay, only three dams. Which might not be enough. 
That means you are gonna need another dam as well, but you guys are crossing over somewhere right now. Oh. Okay. Oh dear. We shall. I don't want them running back and forth whilst we are constructing this all in here. Okay, you can go and let's put another dam just about here. Uh, it could also be that we need another dam in there, which means we have to go back into this district. But we don't have blanks here and we have to climb up somehow. Uh, okay. Well, this is not no fun at all. But, right. Might be necessary, so let's plan this in. You can go over. And the drought seems to be starting already. Well, that's a very short rainy season, isn't it? Okay, off you go. Right over there. And this one... Hmm. <laughs> and the route, we are gonna send you some planks. We're not gonna need a whole ton of them, so we shall do the same thing. Set it to five. All right. Unpause you, and I'd like to bring some columns. I think I know where. I think I know where they're gonna come from. So let's see. Forestry. Send one. Um, hmm, <laughs> Hello? You might have actually gone to one of the other buildings. Uh, highest priority? No. Okay, we should have two in here now. Oh, yes, we do. No, that's not what we needed. One is enough. Okay, we'll slow down the time just a tiny bit as well. And if you could, start with those projects first and... Where are you? Are you still running over? Okay. Let's have a look at this progress as well. Alright, okay. So that is not bad at all. And I guess what we're just going to have to do is... We'll do platforms like so. Is this going to help us? Yes, it seems. And perhaps focus on this first so we can start building these batteries as well. Another thing we are going to need is to pull over those power lines. The easiest way to do this. Uh, this one is a little bit annoying. Not super easy. I mean, we can always climb down, I suppose, from here as well. Yep, so let's plan this out. Then all of these ones, I suppose from here we can go down, cross over, up, or should we cover, go over this road? Well, that's going to take a whole lot more lengths. And to be fair, this corner one... Uh, no, we are going to need it right now because the beavers like to... like to walk on it. Okay. Yeah, we'll set you up like so. Just to pass the power through. And... <laughs> going... Oh, you are going to have to walk up here, isn't it? So we'll give you a little bit of space. Yep, right about there. Then turn from this side. You are going to receive it. This one goes above. Connect you. Okay, I'm starting to like this. You go over, but we do have to remove the trees. Okay, going up from here can be normal again. Just a little step up and then we shall just do the same thing. Go up from all the way here. We are going to have to cross somewhere about here. And this corner section actually is where we send the power up. Well, eventually. Yeah. Alright. Have we done any of those platforms? Seems like they are. And if we really want to, at the end, once the sort of the stair system is complete, we can... Oh, that's what we had to do. We didn't even have to construct those ladders over here. All we needed was a platform. Okay, the more you know... Right, so 1,500 science in the bank right now. Not quite the 2,000 that we do need. Are you going to take some power as well? Of course you are. 
Right, what's our... Hmm, production is pretty low. I am thinking we might even want to... To a few more windmills. We, we're just going to queue it up for, for the time being at least. And let's see, are you guys focusing on the right things? I think uh, not all of you. But it doesn't matter, it needs to be done all the way around eventually anyways. Right, have we flooded anything else? Oh yes we have. Uh, <laughs> so maybe we block you in in this corner as well because it seems to be... Yeah, that's where we have a bit of a problem. Uh, you guys are going over already. And... Okay, we've got the fourth dam now in place. Uh, drought is almost here. You are done as well. So we are going to have to temporarily remove at least one. Let's see if you can construct it. Yes, you are already running over, so that's good. And with you guys, these levees are being completed as well. Okay, lovely, very lovely indeed. Uh, I think they haven't been able to focus on this area much because we are prioritizing our battery system over here. Yes, that does indeed seem to be the case. So, yeah, let's just get it done. We are going to go... How far do we have to... Oh, we don't have to go any higher than this, actually. Yep, this goes here. Uh, nothing to do in range. Let's have a look. Alright, you've pretty much done everything in here, which is very, very good. Why don't you grab a few more trees if you have the reach for this. And we might give you a slightly high priority as well. Get those stairs done so that way we can... Alright, beautiful. Oh, that is not beautiful at all. Um, <laughs> right, one, two, three. Oh, I see. These ones, let me just remove you for for the time being. We probably do need one, two, right. Well, there we go. I think all of them will have to be dams instead of levees. And maybe even three in here. As I think about it, might be, yeah, might be necessary. Just a day left until the drought arrives. Uh, even if we don't get these sections done, I'm not going to be super, super mad with the beavers. Uh, this is fine. I mean, it would be great if we can, if we could store a bit more water uh, just about here. But the key thing is this one. You are done. And let's take a look at... Yeah. Okay. So let's hide the water. We are going to need a few more dams in this area. Okay, highest priority. Get this done. And I think just in case, we are going to do one more. Okay, I know you're out of reach right now, but we'll get there eventually. So our metal stockpile 65 right now. Which I assume... You guys are using up mostly. So we had a few spare bots already as well. Let's put them working 24-7. And once we get 10,000 points, well, it's not going to happen in this episode. But in the future, once we do, then the assemblers will be running with bots next. Okay. Power-wise, uh, they, yeah, too many jobs. So this is going to take quite a quite a bit of time. Let's let the game run a little bit and then we shall jump right back. All right, we are jumping back and it is not unfortunately because the battery is full, but I've noticed something. Uh, we had an extra levy right over there that was blocking the water flow. All right, that should be fixed now. I'm glad we got it just before the drought starts. So hopefully in this 0.3 days we can fill 
this whole area up with a little bit more water. Okay, there we go. And now let's have a look at this progress as well. Uh, right, we have one, two, three more levels in total. So halfway there, really. Okay, there we go. The drought has started, which means normal water will be flowing in here. But that's all right. It seems the area is filled up pretty nicely. Uh, you are still operational. Pause when above. Uh, maybe we'll drop you just a little bit. Okay, there we go. That should be sufficient. Uh, <laughs> let's have a look. Have you guys managed to complete anything else? I mean, I don't expect you... Expect you to... Few more levies. Interesting. They managed, oh yeah, they've done them from below. Okay, fair enough. And these ones will be done very quickly as well. I think the key thing for me really is just to get the ladder system completed first. And here we can see a few beavers climbing directly up and down. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, right, yeah. So let's have a quick zoom around the map. Drought, another 27 days. So that is a pretty, pretty long time. And somehow this area is flooded yet again. And I think I even completely missed how it happened. But yeah, there's only one way to fix this. We are going to have to climb over and try and raise the levee wall just a little bit. Uh, okay, fine. It's not a, not a biggie. Uh, we got this section done over here. And the same with you, which makes you... A little bit more free. Actually, we also have more than 2,000 points, so we can look at the terraforming real quick. All right, so here we go. Dirt excavator. Uh, you are going to take 50 metal, 100 treated planks, and 100 gears. Right, metal probably is going to be a bit problematic, but we shall unlock you anyways. Right, so I guess what we are also going to have to do, we shall have to... Why do I have those platforms here? I have absolutely no idea. But that's all right. We shall clean up this space just a little bit in here. And maybe we'll figure out how we want to place the excavators. Uh, yeah, so that's where we are going to put those excavators dig it down a little bit, gather some dirt. I hope the dirt pile isn't going to be too expensive. Okay, so 500. And then we also need a terraforming station. Okay, right, I think, oh yeah, okay. So that's going to take up quite a bit of science, but that's fine. Today's focus is just getting this monstrous tower ready here. And because we are not going to be able to place too many off Let's see. Off the platforms anyways. Let's pause this section. We'll get a corner of this done. And then hopefully we see it in action as well. Yeah, so you two go over there. I really hope they should be able to construct them because I've left the last one one level. And with a bit of a walkway right underneath. Now what... We should check, however. Oh yeah, this might... Hmm. Let's pause them for a second. Uh, right, right, right. Let's go to power. You are going to be the first one. Oh, actually, we could extend it. I think... Yeah, I messed it up a little bit. Okay, there we go. Uh, this one is going to be here, which means you go there and we need another platform, another gravity battery. They will be connected up and we are going to have to pass the power through as well. Okay, beautiful. And with this corner, I think we are going to do something like so in here. If we can, if we cannot, then we'll use the, this pillar. Actually, why don't we do it straight away? No, let's see. Let's see how it goes first. Uh, these ones, yep, everything should be fine. And you know what? Let's 
uh, pause this section actually as well. I just really want to get some of them done already. There we go. Just a uh, just another level left over here. I should have given you a slightly high priority. Okay. Uh, so there we go. These guys will pass through here in the future. Actually, what I should have done, we can expand it just a little bit. But my intention, I really hope this isn't going to be a permanent solution here. Someone has nothing to do in range. Oh, that's you again. Uh, right. What shall we do with you? So you can go this way if we give you a slightly higher priority. And everything... Ah, oh, you're already marked. Okay, let's give you a slightly bigger area. Right, so the top was dammed in, but it seems... It was not in time. Slightly lower priority. Let's, let's get the stairs done. So at least we can gather some more logs for this district. You have no one working here. Alright. And we'll close you up then. And the farming corner. Now we still have to plant a few trees. But it's night time already. Uh, <laughs> I mean... Let's just get it done, shall we? Where do we have a spare column? Oh, okay, so you are in District 1. Okay, District 1, send one over. And a high priority. Okay, you're already working here, which is wonderful. Once that is done, I think we can pause the distribution as well. Yeah, there's enough biofuel there. So let's put you on pause for the time being. And also all these areas I think we can remove as well. I have left a couple of trees in here just to make it a little bit more natural looking and nicer in a way as well. And once these trees are in, we can unmark them. So in the future they will kind of start spreading all over the place. And same with this birch tree over here as well. Uh, you are already fully matured, so... We should see some little ones around this area soon. Okay. Right. Let's look at our battery tower one more time. Okay. So this platform should be next. One more and then we should be good. We are just missing a road. Just like so. And I think what we can do. We could set this. Uh, you're not going to have... Mm, let's see if they will... Uh, actually, no. Let's pause you. And we need those sections done first. Okay. Uh, beautiful. All right. Let's let the game run for a little bit. And then we shall be back. All right. And our first battery is now, in, now complete. It seems to be bringing in about 62,000 hamster power. We should get the second one uh, up and running pretty soon as well. But right now we are a little low on the blanks. Right. Um, unfortunately the next phase of our construction is going to require quite a few blanks as well. So we might have to allow it a little bit of time to build up the stockpiles. Uh, if we can highlight you all oh, slightly high priority. Okay, there you go. And I would love for you to also complete as many of these sections as you can. Uh, in here. Alright. This one might be a bit problematic. And actually same with you guys. Uh, oh dear. Okay. Let's um, fix this up real quick. We are going to need platforms in these locations. And then we also have to climb up here now, don't we? So the easiest way to do this is... Okay, two should be doable, right? And what do you require? Okay, so we've got tons in here. So we shall get this link done. Okay, beautiful. Uh, for the power, we are still going to have to dismantle that tree over there. But over here, once these are ripped out, we will do a little stepping stone. 
Uh, I think we can cancel dismantling these trees in here. Because we are going to follow the same sort of direction and route where everything already is. Yep, so let's do one over there. Quite a few going straight up. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Not here. Okay, vertical one. And this one can come out as well. So all we need now is you to go this way. You this way. And the last corner piece. Just like so. Okay, actually I do know why we ran out of those blanks. And I'm glad we bossed the other, other side of this construction. Because then we wouldn't even have the first battery up and running. Uh, right, yeah, we need quite a lot of them. Gears right now, how many do we have? 358, we are rocking uh, six plants over here. Okay, so the first thing that I can think of, we could probably send and build you elsewhere. Uh, <laughs> well, there's a beautiful spot right over here, but you are also going to require... Require some planks, aren't you? Alright. Uh, I guess we shall let it run for a little bit. And then as soon as we can construct the rest of it, we'll be, we'll be right back. Okay, so there we go. We have finally completed this uh, power shaft. Uh, that took way too long because they had to be completed one at a time. And each of them was dependent on the, uh, the one before. But yeah, it's, uh, it is functional now. We are definitely sending power through. Supplies currently higher than the demand. Um, but yeah, uh, there is about 124,000 hamster power that's being stored in those batteries. And as the time goes along, we shall definitely construct more and more of them around this corner. So yeah, hopefully that's going to keep this... Um, industry running even when the wind is down but uh, I think we can be pretty happy with this so let's call it an episode here and we shall continue in the in the next one all right so thank you so much for watching I'll see you in the next episode